YouTube, it's your boy Mr. Waving, and today I'm back with another video. But before I get too far going in this video, I'm gonna need for y'all to hit that subscribe button, turn on that post notification bell, hit that like button, comment on this video, and follow me on my Instagram at Mr. Underscore Wavy843. Let's get into the tube. It's your boy Mr. Waving, and I'm back up in this thing with another video. And today's video is gonna be about your crown for beginner waivers and also an OG waiver did tip these tips for everybody really but before I get too far going in this video I'm gonna need for y'all to hit that like button hit that subscribe button turn on that notification bell sus subscribe did I say subscribe twice and follow me on Instagram Mr. Underscore Waver 843 and today's video is gonna be about how to brush a crown so with that being said is it true that you should start on your crown first. It's a yes and it's a no. Why I say it's a no? Because doing your brush system, we always start right here. And when you brushing from here to your hairline, that always disturbs your crown and get it out of place. But really, we should start out, start brushing right here. After we isolate our crown, we should always brush away from a crown so it won't be disturbed so that why i say you should focus on your crown last to help keep it in place and also i'm gonna show you how to brush your crown with the pre wp brush i had this brush for a little minute i, I think that you can get this brush at 360wayprocess.com but with that being said, I'm about to take it out of the packet and show y'all how to brush our crown. As you can see, my crown is pretty much in place like I want it. But I'm just showing y'all how I'm going to brush my crown. So, you always want to brush your crown but you always want to tap your crown you know shout out to AZ because it's a method you basically don't want to use all of your brush if you was using a brush like this you just want to use the tips and corners of the brush so I'm going to show you with the 3WP crown brush first how to brush your crown Always want to take your time and brush slow. And don't worry about these lines. That's just showing you the ways that you need to brush your crown. That's all that is. And don't focus on one side of your crown because you can always focus on one side of your crown too, so much that it can mess with the other side of your crown. Now for the long hand, now time for the long handle brush. This is a medium part if I brush king. So you want to tap, don't brush, tap. Neutron, you made this. Play, 
pay close attention on how I'm brushing my palm. As you can see, I'm not brushing it like mm -hmm. I'm, I'm brushing it with the tips. Don't rag up until you feel like your crown is in place and that you're satisfied with it. I have no products in my hair, so that's the other reason why my hair is moving so easily and so freely. You don't want to apply products to your hair every day. You always want to keep your hair where it's easy and manageable to move. good enough right here. I don't want to bore, bore y'all with the same thing. And another thing what I like to do is before I rise up is I like to take my finger and move the hairs around my crown and make sure my hair is and make sure my crown is really in place. We all see them ring this woman. Alright YouTube, that was the video. Like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy Mr. Wavy. Check out all my other videos that's gonna pop up in the iCars. And I'm gonna pop up, have pop up at the end of this video. So uh subscribe, turn on that post notification bell. Peace.